So if you're interested in mindfulness, which is something I've talked about before on this podcast, and I I sort of made some uh, off the cuff jokes about the opposite of mindfulness being mindlessness. Mindfulness is a vast space. That is a mindful practice that a lot of people have engaged in. And indeed it can give you deeper appreciation for things that you already have. Dopamine has the quality of making people kind of rabidly in pursuit of things. Look at people who are high on cocaine or amphetamine and they are almost entirely exteroceptive. Drugs like marijuana, the opioids, anything that um, really hits the serotonin system hard tend to make people rather lethargic and content to stay exactly where they are. They don't pr- want to pursue much at all. Uh, occasionally when people it, uh, smoke marijuana or consume THC, their appetite goes way up and they really want to consume food. That's because of its effects on insulin and its effects on blood sugar, which is a slightly separate matter. But since some of you uh, probably your minds might have gone uh, to your to those either experiences or reports of what pot does, um, that's why it does that. 